Hello all and welcome to Magus Craig Gaming. Alright, tonight we are playing Stay Out. I am in the warehouse, the military warehouse. And I'm just going to be grinding dogs for a while. I'm only carrying my double barrel shotgun and 200 rounds. And I'm intending to pick up anything these dogs drop. And a little bit of other loots that I can find in here in terms of uh, different items that will be in the warehouses and i'm just gonna grind for a while uh gonna be doing this for i don't know a couple hours maybe more to get my uh money back up all right i don't think it'll take long to do that because i have quite good butchering skill and to be honest i'm on premium which means i will make a good amount of money he's coming let's go ahead and shoot him i don't want to get hurt i could have grabbed that really quick but we'll go ahead and get it now if i'm going to be in this area i'm going to have to do that i want to take that out of my pocket there we go that feels better all right, we'll get that. Someone's in here. I'm going to have to be cautious. I don't know if they'll kill me or not. They're shooting everything. I think they're just doing it for experience. Let's go over here. All right, we're going to get this farthest one first. Now, these other ones are going to respawn soon. So I'm going to have to get out of here before I get too attacked and I only have the one gun so I can't react too much in here but let's see after this we've got 25 meat couple of hides no dog skins yet and some lead sounds like they're outside the walls all that rats getting me Alright, let's go ahead and run this way. There's a dog. Oh, I'm poisoned. We're going to use an antidote. We're going to go ahead and drink. Alright, that'll keep us from being poisoned. Alright, we're going to come over here. And we're going to loot this dog because no one else is looting it. It's free stuff. There's another dog over there. Alright, we're going to go ahead and walk in here. Alright, there's two more dogs. Drop him. Let's we'll see if we can get this before it disappears. So we got one of them. Free, free uh, meat. And no use of gunshot or uh, bullets, so no damage on the gun and no uh, five meat off that. That was uh, really good. Let's see where we're at. 36, and I'm going to go until I'm at 49, and then I can go right next door and sell it. This is a good method, especially if it's not camped, but it's a... Uh, mission area so a lot of the times it is camp oh i just heard someone shoot over there let's check this out real quick bingo let's see what we get out of this some meds or something nah nothing spectacular but we'll take it let's see if there's anything else here Look around. And I would suggest turning up the contrast to 100 and the brightness to at least 50. That's what I did with this uh, monitor, and it does pretty well. I can see pretty good now. Let's head over this way. Looks like somebody's killing some stuff in here. But here's some more dogs, so we'll come over here. Oh, we got one coming. That one ran away. We'll take this one down. 
There's another one over there we can get. It's raining. Could you imagine if there was weather effects like weather could hurt you or something? Or uh, make you cold like in scum? That would really add an element to this game that I've... I mean, it might be interesting, but it might be difficult. I don't know. Like, you'd have to get, like, rain ponchos or something if you wanted to be out in the rain. I'm glad they don't really, though, because I want the game to be somewhat not so bad when it comes to those things. Like, you can actually have a little bit of fun. I do, I, I do like some realism, though. I do. Where is there another one? Let's reload. Alright, three down. Let's get the meat. We've got 46 meat. I think we'll be able to get upwards of 150 meat. In one sitting. And we'll be grinding points. Look at that, six meat. I love it when I get that. The highest I've gotten is eight. The highest I've gotten is eight with the uh, double reward for meat and everything, which is really cool. I like it. Um, I did post something on the boards. I don't know if uh, people will like it in terms of a good change for the game, but I thought they should add something to the animals, particularly in this game, and that is... Like for dogs, uh, like say, oh shit, here comes another one. Damn, they all came at once. Here comes another one. Holy shit, that's rough. Hopefully I can get all these. Uh, as I was saying, um, like meat portions. Like you could get so much meat off the dogs. And, like, you could get ears and paws and stuff like that to uh, elaborate more than I did. And the same thing with, like, the boar and the bear. You can get, like, different parts off of them. Depending on your skill will give you, like, say you have full-out butchery. all Everything's trained. You can get the max amount off everything, like, extra meat and stuff. And if they do premium, then you can double or maybe just... 30 or 40 extra percent of the meat like say you found a bigger ant you find bigger animals when you're doing premium or something like that um that could be a nice additive or maybe they could just add some of the things like the paws and different things like that um i do i don't mind how it is it's it works well but i think it could be some adjustments to make it more of a realistic feel um, to butchering an animal. Oh, shit, that hurt. Come on, motherfucker. Oh, my God, what the fuck? Motherfucker. That was ridiculous. Made me shoot around him twice. Fucking stupid stuff. That really irritates me when that happens. If I'm aiming at the motherfucker, I should be able to stick that barrel right on the motherfucker and shoot it. It shouldn't go around the goddamn dog. Just because it's a long barrel. That's really irritating. Fucking shit. That's one thing I really don't like about fighting any animal that's up close. Is it seems to make your gun... You have to back up to shoot it. And it's just... It's really annoying. I mean, I don't mind backing up sometimes. But sometimes I don't think to back up. Because I'm just trying to aim at the damn thing. Alright, we're going to go over here and check this for any kind of goodies. I don't see anything in there. Let's see what we got weight-wise. We're at 31, so we've got about 20. Well, I'd say about... We're at almost 31.5. So... God damn it, I missed him. Uh, so we're 32 now. So that's what, um, 9 plus 8, 17 
Total KG. Fucking rat. Fuck you, rat. Fucking rat. I'm gonna fucking kill you. Bitch. I hate those fuckers when they do that. Eat that, you son of a bitch. Yeah, fuck those rats. Those rats are fucking stupid. They don't give you shit. And all they do is fuck with you and they're hard to aim at. Fucking things irritate me. Here comes some more. Fucker. God damn it. Motherfucker. And they go around you. Fucking stupid shit. Really agitating. This guy must be a, a seasoned vet. What's this guy doing? I don't know what he's doing. Is he gonna give me something? I, I don't understand. Oh shit. He gave me a he's giving me a flashlight kind of thing. Oh he's giving me money too, holy shit. That's fucking cool. Okay, let's see what he does. He'll make the offer. I'll let him do it. I don't know what he's... I'm not sure what he's doing here. Oh, okay. I, I don't know. Maybe he didn't... He wanted 20000 for it, I'm guessing. Oh, yeah. And if you come in here... When you're in here... You can refill your flask and everything right here. You can drink and refill your flask real quick. So this is a good station to come in here and uh, refill your container and flask if you're around this area. Oh, Phil. And I don't know what this is. Oh, I don't know if you can go down in there or not. Let's see what's over here. Some more dogs. I want to get some more meat. Come on, ugly. Fucking rat. Fuck you. Bitch. Fucking rats. Fucking, I'll shoot them. I hate them. They're fucking nuisance. You don't get anything off them. You should get like a, I don't know, like a rat pelt that you can trade in for small amounts of ammo or some shit. That's an idea. I should post that up on the suggestion board. Alright, let's go shoot some more dogs. We're gonna shoot this fucker right here. Alright, come on, ugly. Let's watch these damn dogs. He came from far away. I want to try and avoid getting damage. I think I only have two car kits. Yeah, and one's half gone. Oh, uh -uh, you ain't attacking me, you rat.
Aw, oh, shit. This one's coming at me. Alright, let's get these. Alright, we're going to get all these if we can. I definitely want all these. That's meat. Let's see what my burden's at. I think after I do these, I'll be close to time to... Oh, it's going to stop raining. Four. Let's check this one. Let's see where we're at. I think we're going to get a lot of meat. We're at almost 100 now. Might as well say 100. So we're doing pretty good. Some people, I mean, there are quite a few people I've ran into trying to kill me. I've been killed a few times, shot in the back and stuff. And one time I logged on the alternate character, tried to get in a group with these guys. They totally ignored me, and I found them out and about just standing, so I shot them. I just shot them because they were just ignored me, and I didn't like that. Is he going to try and take my other one? I don't know who this guy is. Is that a Russian? Or is it somebody else? Oh, I know him. He's a... I've seen him before. I don't know of him, but I've seen him before. Alright, let's see what we're at. We got plenty of room to go. So we're probably going to get, a, I'd say, another 80 to 90 uh, meat. So we're going to keep stacking that, and then we're going to see how much we make. And I'm losing weight on ammo as I go. Uh, what do I got? I got 160 ammo, so I can kind of gauge how much it takes to get that much meat. And I can take the appropriate amount of ammo. Maybe a little bit more than the appropriate amount of ammo. So the weight ratios are balancing out. And I get more uh, meat per trip. Good calculation, I think. Let's go up here. Let's see if they come. It's going to come up here. Boom. Uh, that might be difficult to get. Oh, let's get up here. Alright, three. Alright, we got him. He's in the brick, but we got him. Now, you can do this throughout the whole map area. I just choose to do it in here because it's secluded and it's a decent area to get a lot of spawns and easy a lot of spawns and an easy way to kill them without getting overwhelmed and if you really need to there's a way to get run to run away and come back really quickly let's check this uh next warehouse real quick i want to see if there's anything oh here he comes he's gonna come around here he comes we're gonna let this go He got a little damage on us, but not much. We'll take it. Let's see where we're at. 125. We we are going to be able to pick up a lot more meat. And uh, we're going to get off that. We're going to hit these guys. Oh, I achieved Dog Hunter. That's really cool. I don't know what that does, but I'll take it. Next, I want to get Boar Hunter, but that is going to be difficult because Boar, you know, Boar only spawn in the mornings. And, I mean, I'd really like to see a lot more Boar. I'd like to hunt more Boar, uh, but you can only hunt so many of them because they only spawn so often. And their spawns are different than the, the dogs, and I find it to be a little frustrating. If they were as spawnable... If they spawned as much as the dogs, I would love it to find an area with about four to five of them and just sit for a while and enjoy myself and kill them and get some hides and stuff. 
maybe I had a big backpack and I could get quite a bit of meat, quite a bit of hides and all that stuff, it would be nice. But uh, it's unfortunate that there's only two boar that I know that spawn on this in this particular area. And uh, it's hard to actually get kills on them because there's so many people in this area that are new. I went outside the gate with this character and I was able to get three or four boar kills. And then I got smoked by some weird Halloween dude or something. I don't know, some kind of dude that put a curse on me or something. It's an NPC, like weird, weird wizard or some shit. I don't know, but... Uh, that was a little frustrating, but I didn't lose anything particularly too bad. I lost a, a leg from the boar and a few pieces of meat and a couple other things, but I didn't lose anything particularly too valuable, so uh, I just called it good, and I didn't kill the last boar over by that character, and I just ran back into town and sold. So we've got 145 meat, and we still have about 8 kilograms to go. So, we're going to get a lot here. Let's see where we're at. That was a bad shot. First shot, I should have waited until he was closer. Okay, this bush. There's one back there. Someone's got a Mossberg. Oh, someone's over there. Oh, they're outside. They're outside the gate. The gated complex. They're out. Or the yeah, the gated complex. They're outside. They're outside the warehouse. The military warehouse. Now, oh, what are we going on? Twenty-two minutes it's taken us to do this. Let's get over here and see if he'll follow me. We're gonna run over here. want to be a relatively close to this area in case I need to run a little bit out and not get too many spawn on me. So about 10, 10, 10 or so meat will weigh uh, one kilogram. Let's see. Yeah, um, approximately. Actually a little more than that, but... Probably nine meat weighs one kilogram. Let's go ahead and split this. We're going to go nine. And then we're going to go ahead and go info. Not point nine. So one kilogram is ten. Like I thought. Okay. So we're getting quite a bit here. Fuck you, rat. I hate those goddamn rats. Alright, let's reload before this one gets too close. Oh, I got him just in time. I, I hit that tire. I hit that tire, but that's okay. We got him eventually. Let me see what I got to eat. Canned stew. That's okay. I got quite a bit of hides, too, and those weigh a lot. But they're not worth a shit they're very low value and so is the lead so let me look at this lead info very little kilogram so I ain't worried about it let's look at the info on this that's 9.6 and that's probably worth maybe 10 I could get 90 more or almost 100 more meat for those those are not valuable at all the meat is what's valuable in my opinion so I might actually, let's go ahead and shoot at him. Get him to come out. I might actually drop those hides because those hides mean nothing to me. If they were usable for points, I'd keep them. But you don't get any fucking points for those. You don't get any credits. They should make credits for them. Oh my god, what the hell? I was aiming right at him. That was wrecked. I fucked that up bad. Or maybe I wasn't aiming at him. It looked like I was. 
I was almost done. I should have finished. Where are we at? 167. And we're at 43.62. All right. $115 per hide. Those hides should be so worth more. Those hides should be worth more. The hide should be worth more than the meat, in my opinion. Holy shit, he took two clipped. He took two rounds. Clip rounds. I clipped him twice, but he took two of them. He should have been dead, though. In my opinion, he should have been. Where are we at? We got this. We can get the rest of this meat off these guys. I'm surprised I haven't got a dog skin. Alright, come this way, buddy. All these dogs and I haven't got a dog skin? That's kind of crazy. That's really crazy. Especially when you can see this is my butchering. That's 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 crazy. That's crazy. I I'm really surprised I haven't had like seven or eight of those or more. Maybe it's because I'm hunting in here instead of outside of here. No, nah, I don't think so. That wouldn't make sense. That's kind of crazy though. That's kind of crazy. I don't understand why I'm not getting dog skins. check up there and see if I can go in it looks like there's a hatch to go in it there's hatches on all of them I wonder if there's something up, up there at all you can overlook people you could snipe people here you could get up here just Cool, cool. There's a dog. How much? Let me look at this. 25. Okay, a little bit of damage, not much. Let's get these guys coming. three more let's get them this will get me about maybe 1.5 1.8 weight we're getting there now a piece of, of meat cooked is worth 220 um, eats and these cans will feed you four sh shots of 200 Four charges of 200 they're about $1,300 and you can get that with about three meats three meats will run you about a thousand dollars in sales so the three meats four meats will run you over uh, you'll get a little bit more but um, I'm not I'm thinking that eating the meat might be better than getting the actual uh, uh, canned meat but cooking your own meat I think is better and then if you have access you can sell it for really high look at that we're going to have 200 meat alright 
right, did I get a, I got, I am not getting any dog skins. So, you know what? I'm probably going to do this outside of here next time. Because I want the dog skins. Because those are good for, uh, if I get 200, let's see, how much am I? I'm still at 124. So, all this meat, I could get a lot more uh, for my buck if I have, like, maybe 135, 140-ish uh, ammo. I can get a lot more meat because I'll get down farther in terms of weight with my ammunition. So, I'm thinking, I'm thinking 150. Oh, I almost thought I was going to miss him. Oh, let's back up. Oh, we're going to run. We're going to run a little bit. Reload. Alright. Now we'll come back. We'll get these real quick. Alright, let's get these. Alright, so... I think I'm going to stock about... 135, 140 ammo. And we'll go ahead and see how much we can get stocked up. I might go 150 ammo. I don't know. 150 might be pretty good. It depends on where we burn, what we burn here to the 49. It's going to be close to 100. So I think the 150 will be a good mark to go with to get what we want for meat and hides. Oh, we're only getting one meat now. Go ahead and come over here, ugly. So it's been about 32 minutes and I've got 200 meat. Uh, this is going to be pretty close to what I get. I'll probably get about 220, I think. 210-ish. Alright. Unless I drop some of them hides, so I'll get a lot more. But we're we're running pretty close to full. And if you grind this out, you'll get you'll get a lot of a lot of okay, that's pretty close. I think we'll do one more dog. Let's do one more dog right over here. Let's get over here and see if we can get one to follow us if there's any. Uh, we'll go out. Let's go out. We'll run over here. Alright, we'll go ahead and sell. So, we don't need a whole lot of ammo. Um, I could probably suffice with the ammo I have, but I do want a little extra ammo. And uh, the dog skins are not sellable here at the highest price, if I remember right. The highest price, I think, is 115 So let's see how much. I think they're worth 77 here. So that's not a lot. We'll, we'll check. So let's look at what this gets us. 61 k All right, we're going to go ahead and do that because I want to see what this dog hides. 30 dog hides. 77 2,000 some odd K. We're going to keep those. That's a little bit of weight. Oh my gosh, look at these. We're buying those. 10K, I'll take it. Okay, now you might be asking yourself, why did I buy those? Well, you will soon see. Because we're headed back to the starter area. I'm going to buy ammo. I'm going to sell those hides. And then I'm going to come back. But I'm going to find a spot where I can... Go ahead and kill dogs outside of that area and maybe because i'll be outside of that area i'll get dog skins for some reason i'm not getting dog skins and i don't understand why my knife is still pretty decent so let's go ahead and run a little bit over here we're gonna kill that dog 
Oh, it died really easily. I didn't need to shoot both of those rounds off, but that's okay. We'll get a little bit of dog meat here for our start. And if we get any dog hides, we'll be uh, doing pretty good with that. I might just sell the meat. Nah, I'll hold on to it and see what we get. I might actually cook it because I think cooking that would be better than buying the stewed meat because <clears throat> it's free and uh, cooking it is not that hard. <coughs> yeah, we got eight meat. There goes player. They're probably over there shooting at other players or they're... You know, this area, I didn't think I'd be PK'd in a lot, but I was. Ooh, goblin. I want to kill that. We're going to kill that goblin and that dog. Alright, we're going to go ahead and aim. When you aim like that, you take them out a lot easier. Where's the other dog? Oh, he's right there. Okay. See that goblin over there? We're going to kill him. He's 120 uh, experience. And he shouldn't be that hard to kill. One shot should kill him. Uh oh. Alright, that was luck. Lucky we got him. We just leveled up. Alright, let's loot. And let's check our level. I can get this now. Wait, Kip. Oh, I need more points. It's only one per level. I thought as you leveled higher, you got more points. So I gotta wait three levels to get that KG up. That's okay. We'll wait. I like to scan. Make sure nobody's creeping up on me. Because I have been smoked quite a few times. Looting. Can of coffee. I hear somebody. Oh, it's Goblin. One shot killed it. 120. The canned coffee is cool to get, I think. I don't know how many points I get for it. If I get credits for it, but... Goblins spawn here and over on Lennon Street and Lennon Street in the housing. I didn't get nothing off that one. That was rough. Alright, let's go ahead and eat some stewed meat. We're going to eat this while we have it. I'm going to cook two, two of this. I wish I could use that campfire, but I got to make my own. Alright, let's go campfire. Kindle right there. We're going to cook this meat. We're going to try and cook all of it. Well, double dose of it. And I should be able to. I did 93 ammo with all that. So, you know, 200 meat plus with 93 ammo. I think 107... I'm going to go to 130. I think that will be plenty of ammo. I might even go to 138. So I have a total of 140. I think I'll do that. You'll see what I'm going to do with these soon. Yeah. 
Is this the guy I shot? Yeah, it is. He's got an AK now. I wonder if he's going to say anything. Throw that on there. I gotta watch out for him. I smoked him once. He shot another player, so I shot him dead. Took his shit, too. Got about 29 PS rounds for the SKS. A few other things. So I got maybe a... Maybe a thousand worth of money or so. Maybe a little bit more. That'll cook. I don't need to put anything else on it. Let's take that. We're going to sell these. How much is the weight on these? 12.8. Now, for that amount of kg, I could get 128 more. What the hell? Fucker shot me. Fucker shot me. I don't know how he did that without getting shot. Fucking dickhead. I'm gonna shoot him over and over now. I'm not gonna have any mercy on him. I was gonna leave him alone after that, but you know what? You wanna fuck around? Okay, you won't be around, boy. Fucking piece of shit. Shoot me. I shot you because you were shooting someone else, and then you get outside the boundaries like a little bitch and snipe me while I'm in town, pussy boy. Let's throw one more on that. He just made an enemy. I was going to leave him be after this. But he just made an enemy. I was going to leave him be... From the first time I killed him. When I saw him kill somebody. But now he just made me an enemy. I'll kill him every time I see him now. Alright we're going to put that in there. That in there. That in there. That in there. Alright. Now if you want to you can sell. I'll show you where to sell these hides real quick. 115 is the max you're going to get. So you see there, a little bit more money. And I don't think you get any credits for them. No, you don't. Let's go ahead and sell these. We'll sell those too. 
And I've got 12 meat. Let's go ahead and eat uh, some stew. And we're going to come out here. Uh, actually, before we do that, I think I'm going to put one leg in here because I don't have 20. I think I got a leg in here, two legs in here. Let's go ahead and divide this one because you only can do it in sets of five. So we'll put those there. Alright, we're going to do this three times, this gives me points, uh, XP, so I just got 3000 XP and 3900 rubles. And I got points for the station for doing that. So I'm at 182 now and I'm down in burden. Let's sell the rest of my lead. We'll sell the we're gonna go ahead and do this real quick. We're gonna fix my clothing. I always do that. And then we'll go here. We'll trade uh trade for sale. Let's sell this. We'll sell that, uh, and we'll take, let's see, let's add, um, let's see, I want 38, so 31, so that'll give me, oh, I, is that all I need? Shoot, yeah, that's all I need, 38 gives me 100, 140 rounds is all I need. All right, so we're going to head out. I might kill that guy. What do we got now? Everything's put away. All right, let's see about this motherfucker. Where is he? I'm going to save my uh, juice. Or my uh, endurance for when I run into them so I can chase them down and shoot them if I have to. I think that's him up there. It looks like he's fighting somebody. I don't know if that was him or not, but they're gone. We'll keep on running. Let's go ahead and loot this. Oh, I need to fix up my knife, too. One eighty K. I think I'm going to get rid of those dog hides really quick. I don't even think I'm going to pick those up anymore. I'll pick them up for now, but I'll drop them later and pick up more meat. Who is this? Japlow. Japlow. Nice name. Japlow. Japlow. We want to respawn right here. Alright, let's go ahead and get rid of some stuff real quick. We're going to go ahead and do sell. We're going to sell that. And we're going to sell that. Um, we'll keep the 12 meat. Sell that. Let's look here. See, those are what I want to get. And I wasn't getting those inside. And I don't know I wasn't. Let's go ahead and check this. It's at 31. I could wait a little bit. I think I'll clean it. Do 
Do I have gun oil? I have gun oil and everything. Oh, okay, it went down. Okay. I was like, what the heck? Uh, where do I want to hunt? I want to be close to Mark, I think. So I have a spot to go. Who is this? I usually miss. He's got, uh, sh uh, what you call it? Oh, he killed this dog. Did he gut it? Yeah, uh, yeah, he took the meat. Alright, come on, doggy. Let's see if we get any hides this time. If we are skins, not hides. Skins we'll keep because they're going to be worth about 3000 bucks a piece or about twelve to 1300 plus. I think it's six points. So I want to stockpile those. Let's hunt for a little bit just to see if that was the reason I didn't get any hides is because I was inside there. Or if it's because of my level or some other reason. I don't think that they would take hides away from me if it was because of my level. I don't think they would do that. Maybe, I don't know. Now right in here, I don't mind hunting in here. It's close to Mark if I need to run or get back. Come on, ugly. The dogs outside the gate are really, they come on you quick. So far, no hides. I don't know why I'm not getting any, or skins. I don't know why I'm not getting any skins. Let's go kill these two dogs. That one's running. We're going to clip it. Alright, we got four there. Here comes another one. That was an alpha dog. Okay, we just got five. Let's see how if we can get these all scooped up real quick. That'll be a good amount of meat. What we at right now? 14. I hope I get a skin or two. Probably only get one if any, but hopefully I get something. I think you get a skin every one or one through ten dogs, really. If you get them. Uh, let me look at this knife. I'm going to fix that knife up here soon. Sounds like someone's using a Mosin and a shotgun. Oh, that's a seasoned vet. Did I get one? I did get one. So it is outside the gate that you get these. Okay, that's interesting. So next we're going to go that far dog, then we're going to come back to this one that's over in front of us because that one we killed. I think that far one was the last one I killed actually. So we'll go ahead. Let's shoot this fucker. Alright, we got that one. Blood all over the tree. Alright, these D pelts, uh, info, they 1.2 gram, 33% chance of losing them on death. But they're, they're uh, exceptionally, they're exceptionally good to have for uh, money. And also, um, 
Oh, the dog disappeared. Damn. I should have went for it first. That's okay. We lost one. I got three hides off that thing. I wish I got these as much as I got these, but I don't. Let's see what the weight of these are. 2.4 for our six of them. So I think every three is about one dog skin. So you, you guys get the gist of this. So you hunt outside, you can get dog skin. And dog skin will give you six credits and about twelve to thirteen hundred money if you go to the station, which is the beginning area, and you sell to the clothing vendor. And if you come here, you will get let's see how much you'll get. I think it's about 2,700. You'll get 2,300, but if you save them and sell them to the cook, you get even more. So, uh, where I sold these two, you saw earlier. That's that, guys. So, I'm going to go ahead. I'm going to sell this. Yeah, just do my thing. 10,000 bucks. So, we're almost at 200K now. Let's see, is there anything I want to buy here? Nothing I want to buy, really. I'm stocking up points with this guy, and I haven't bought nothing from him. I could buy this and this, but I don't want to spend that much. Let's see the, what this does. Hand-to-hand, -hand five radiation, five chemical, polygonal frostbite. Ooh, that's kind of bad. Alright guys, like, subscribe, and comment below, and take her easy.